Lieutenant Cayman Rowe is my name. I'm from the Irish Air Corps and I'm here as part of Science Week 2020. Today's topic is geography. What better place to discuss it than here in the Wicklow Mountains National Park? We're going to show you things from our point of view. The Wicklow Mountains National Park was first established in 1991 and covers an area of about 200 square kilometres. It's estimated that the mountains themselves were originally formed approximately 400 million years ago when colliding plates caused large amounts of molten magma to rise up from the Earth's crust which then cooled to form granite. Much of the terrain such as sharp waterfalls, U-shaped valleys, cliffs and spurs were shaped 10,000 years ago during the Ice Age. Let's take a look at some of these features. Waterfalls are normally found in the early stages of a river and are a consequence of erosion. They are formed where bands of hard and soft rock meet. Hard rock erodes much slower than softer rock and over time the river wears away the softer rock causing a waterfall to form. Spurs are a clearly defined lateral ridge of land that sticks out from a hill or mountain. The water in rivers always flows the path of least resistance. Because of this, spurs are formed as rivers twist and wind their way through a mountain range. As the river erodes the ground below it, it deepens the valley and forms spurs where the river flows around points of high ground. Our helicopter crews train regularly in the Wicklow Mountains and fly close to terrain like this every day. The wide variety of features in Wicklow make for a good training ground. Thanks for joining us on today's Science Week video. Ask us questions about what we've covered or what we do in the comments or as a DM and we'll answer them as part of a question and answer session this Friday. Further information on what we do and recruitment can be found on our various social media channels. Join us tomorrow for another science topic viewed from an aviation perspective.